हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू इंग्लिश ओटेंट क्लासेस एक्सरसाइज ट्वेंटी टू गेट रेडी फॉर द डिकेशन डिकेशन विल बी स्टार्ट इन फाइव सेकेंड इट इज ट्रू दैट आवर एजुकेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन आर फुलफिलिंग टू ए सर्टेन एक्सटेंट द फर्स्ट ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ एजुकेशन स्टॉप द एल्यूमनी ऑफ these institutions are no doubt being acquainted with some part of the accumulated wisdom of the past generations but the purpose for which such equitance is undertaken that is to say to awaken and strengthen and make more capable the individual mind is not being fulfilled stop our young men and women of the rising generation are not found to be savvy of thought stop it is true that from these institutions come out now and then some rare individuals whose mind is full alert awakened and quite forceful stop but i feel that it would not be proper to say in the name of these few and rare individuals that our present educational institutions are illumining the heart of man stop in my view there are several reasons for failure in this direction stop i may mention here some of the most important stop firstly a great part of the accumulated knowledge or experience of the past generations with which your young people are being acquainted in these educational institutions has absolutely no relation or relevance to the daily life of these young people or to the world around them or to their collective life stop naturally this heritage of the past appears to these young people somewhat unmeaningful useless and an assimilable stop it therefore remains a mere burden on their mind and they forget all about it soon after leaving these institutions stop another reason appears to be that the linguistic medium through which they are acquainted with this accumulated experience of the past is not an element of their daily and collective life stop it remains more or less unfamiliar to them in spite of their making all efforts to master it stop it is therefore quite natural that this heritage of ideas instead of being a torch to light the lamp of their mind has become a sort of absorbent which soaks up even the oil of that lamp stop whereas this heritage of the past should have been a lever increasing a thousand fold the capacity of the individual mind it is in fact a short of growing short rendering the latter quite important and ineffective stop but the story does not end here stop our educational institutions are doing almost nothing to realize the other important objective of education stop our students earn hardly for themselves after education stop even this is not all stop finding their labor for years to be quite useless and fruitless for their own life many of our youths are becoming victims of blind discontent 
and anger stop they are not able to see a way out stop moreover they are not even able to acquire a good equitance of the heritage of the past with which these institutions seek to familiarize them stop in my view one of the reasons for the fall in the standards of education of which there is a general complaint today is that our youths do not benefit at all from the education which is being now imparted in our educational institutions stop this poison has not only corroded our individual life but is also now spreading into our collective life stop our present educational system does not concern itself at all with implanting the essential qualities for a collective life amongst our new generation stop so if in this situation our new generation remains devoid of the qualities essential for collective life there should be no reason for surprise stop indeed it appears to me that our present educational system does not at all seem to concern itself with the development of those qualities in our youth which are essential for a good collective life stop our present educational system is thus as unbalanced and ill formed as would appear to be a man with a protruding body and skinny feet and legs stop whatever may be the reason for this the entire effort of our present day educational institutions seems to be merely to equate the students with a very limited aspect of knowledge and not at all to make them skillful at work or good social beings stop i therefore believe that amongst other efforts necessary in this system it is also necessary to establish a balance in its objectives stop we in this country must decide as to how many scholars and skilled workers we require for our country stop it is quite evident that for every age and for every country both scholars and workers are necessary stop but in the circumstances in which our country is placed today we are in need of a larger number of skilled workers as compared to more scholars stop we have to expand our economic production as early as possible so as to meet the needs of the millions of our countrymen stop i may also add that amongst the conditions that have to be fulfilled for expanding production are a fairly good standard of health of our people and familiarity with modern economic and industrial organization and process stop we have to work right now to realize these three objectives as mentioned earlier stop